everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm gonna be unboxing Fortune Cookie Soap's limited edition Halloween box. Um, this Halloween's box is, theme is Snap Snap, which is after the Addams Family, which I absolutely love the movies. Um, so the limited edition box is $19.99 for the box, um, which is significantly cheaper than their monthly subscription, which I believe is about $30 plus shipping, so it's about $35 from what I remember. Um, but this one has significantly smaller stuff and more of like a sample size um, items. So you get the list of products, um, but they don't have any prices or anything like that. So without further ado, we'll get into the box. I've had to refilm this like three times because somebody was leaf blowing and then someone called me and I filmed on my phone. So that's what it looks like when you open up the box. Um, the first thing inside, they put a little thing of Skittles for like Halloween candy, which is super cute. Love that. Nice touch. So the first thing that I am going to pull out is Beware of the Thing OCD Hand Sanitizer. Um, this thing is quite a handful, but forever helpful with kooky scents of baked raspberry, cobbler, caramel, and sugar crystals. Um, open it up. This does smell like really, really, it smells like raspberries, and I prefer, like, if I'm going to have a scented hand sanitizer that has more of a fruity scent, because stronger scents will give me a headache if they're on my hands all day when I'm, like, moving my hands around my face, so I'm excited about this, and this is a good size. It's 1.2, I know it's one ounce, um, but this is basically the size you would get if you went to, like, Bath and Body Works to buy um, a hand sanitizer. The next thing I'm pulling out is Darkness Loves Us Whipped Cream. Um, this has scents of butter toffee, white chocolate drizzled over caramel apples, and a touch of patchouli. Um, this is 1.2 ounces. It smells good. It kind of smells like a craft store in fall mixed with um, cream, if I had to describe it. Um, I have henna on my hand from an uh, international festival I went to, and then I have a band-aid on my thumb, so please bear with me. <laughs> um, this is, I like this, definitely will use this. This will be good for like traveling. Um, to pack with you if you want to use lotion because it's really small. Um, the next thing I'm pulling out is a Stay Creepy Fortune Cookie Soap. Um, mysterious and spooky, banana taffy and cream scents make this Fortune Cookie Soap the best soap in the entire museum. Um, so let's pull this out. So this is what it looks like. I already pulled this out um, earlier. So it has a their traditional fortune cookie soap. It has the rose in it. It has little spider sticking out. And then the fortune inside says, I'll stop wearing black when they make darker a, a darker color. So I love that. It smells so good. It really smells like banana. And, um, and I'm into banana scents. I know not everybody is. And like my hands already smell like banana just from touching it. So very excited about that. Then the next thing I'm seeing is Moncherie Caramia Crypt Spray. Um, to live without this Crip Spray, why that would be torture, and a day alone without the Crip Spray would be death. Scents of sugar plums, exotic black rose, sage, and musk will keep your crypt smelling fresh till death. So let me go ahead and spritz this. Ooh, that smells really nice. I definitely smell the rose, and it smells very, um, like, fresh. Like, it'll, when you spray it, it'll smell fresh. So this is great, and it's a good small size, so if you're, like, traveling and you're in the car or something, this is a, a good thing to take with you. Um, next thing is a Wednesday shampoo bar. You severely underestimate our apathy. Allow black jasmine, sandalwood, and chocolate scents to adorn your braids so you look like a homicidal maniac. They look just like everyone else. Um, I'm not going to open this because I don't want it to start wearing out since I'm not going to use it quite yet. So I can't really smell it through the package, but I love anything scented with jasmine, and it's um, that's what it looks like from the packaging. So I decided to try that out. I don't usually use shampoo bars, but nice to have one. Uh, the next thing I'm seeing is a Cousin It deep conditioner. Um, no need to grab a bowler hat and sunglasses to hide those untamable um, locks. Just grab this deep conditioner that will transform your hair from Cousin It with a rich hazelnut blend, lightly mingled with sour green apple, mold of fruit, and a base of note of pine. Let's open that up and give it a smell. Oh, wow. Um, it's a very unique scent. I can't tell if I like it or not. There are a lot of layers of notes in that. I think I like it, but I think I'd have to, like, um see how it would smell on my hair to know if I would like it because in the jar it'll smell different. I'm not, it's a very complex 
layer of scents, but I think it'll be good. I'm excited to try that. I, I love having deep conditioners and stuff like that. Um, the next thing I'm pulling out is the Altogether Uki Perfume Oil. Neat, sweet, and petite. So get a witch's shawl on, a broomstick you can crawl on, we're gonna pay a call on scents of pink strawberries, pomegranate sorbet, and hollyberry. So let's go ahead and smell that. Just gonna put a little bit here on my wrist. That smells really nice, I love that. Very floral and fruity, but not, but like sophisticated, not young and girly. I really like that. I'm not, I don't, oh, and there's um, also little, rose petals or flower, some sort of flower inside. It smells really good. I don't tend to gravitate towards perfume oils, but i um, excited to add one to my collection, especially since it's a smaller size, so it's easier to use up. And then the last thing in the box is the Over Your Dead Body Body Wash. You would die for this body wash. You would kill for this body wash. Either way, what bliss with a decadent sense of watermelon jelly filled donuts. Give it a smell. Oh, that smells really good. That definitely smells like taking a bath when you're a kid. I don't know why it reminds me of that. Um, but this is a um, one ounce, so this is great to just take with you on a trip if you needed just a little small body wash. Um, I really enjoyed everything I got in the box. Very unique scents that you're not gonna really find anywhere else. Um, if you like the video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you're into unboxing videos, go ahead and subscribe. Um, and I'll see you in my next video.